Today I'm going to be talking to you about how to choose the best dumbbells for your home gym. I'm Kayvon, founder and CEO of Bells of Steel. So let's get into it. So in front of me here, I've got kind of our, our whole range of dumbbells that we sell. And that is a general reflection of the dumbbell market as a whole. And to split them into two groups, you kind of have your fixed head dumbbells and your adjustable dumbbells. So we'll start with a fixed and we'll go with the classic, the rubber hex head dumbbell, which I'm sure you've all seen and used in your local gym. So this is a classic dumbbell. Uh, it's got a fixed head on it, doesn't twist, uh, pretty good durability on it. I haven't seen a lot of dumbbells in my day uh, that you know have a, a head that's actually come off of them. And they also come with a contoured, uh, mildly knurled handle, which is just kind of the classic style. And what you're gonna love about the fixed head dumbbells is that they provide a large range of weight that's easily accessible. So if you're into doing supersets or drop sets, or even uh, just are kind of, you know, like to have that full display of dumbbells in your gym, this is where the rubber hex really shines. And uh, where the downside of them goes is that, of course, to complete a whole set is quite expensive, you know, to have from five pounds to a hundred pounds. And they take up a lot of room too, right? You put them on a dumbbell rack and they take up a decent square amount of square footage. You don't have to buy a whole set, of course. A lot of people will just buy a pair to start and kind of add to their collection. And I mean, a pair of dumbbells by themselves equate to, you know, dozens and dozens of exercises. So overall, a tried and true solution for your home gym. Uh, next, I'll go into our commercial urethane style dumbbells. So again, a fixed head dumbbell, except for this time, it is made out of urethane, which is a odor-free material. And that's a big perk of these. Often you'll see them in commercial facilities or schools that have uh, scent regulations. These rubber hex dumbbells, although our brand isn't too stinky, they do have a bit of an odor, especially when you first take them out of the box. Uh, these are odor free, so they're more of a, yeah, like I said, that commercial material. And they come with a straight knurled handling handle. Uh, really nice knurling on it, really nice fixed handle. I personally prefer a straight uh, handle as opposed to the contoured one, even though it's kind of not industry standard. And again, the, the perks behind these are similar to the, to the rubber hex in that you uh, would have a whole set on display. It's nice to be able to do drop sets and have multiple, again, for a commercial facility, you have multiple uh, people being able to work out at the same time. Again, downsides are similar, uh, take up a lot of space and are quite expensive. They're more expensive than the rubber hex head ones because they're made out of that urethane uh, material, which is, you know, more expensive. And so, yeah, that's kind of your, your fixed uh, options. And I'll move you over to our uh, adjustable option. So there's quite a few different adjustable uh, dumbbells on the market. Uh, Bells of Steel sells the Newell Bell, which is actually kind of a newer adjustable dumbbell to the market, but a extremely well-designed one. And we have our uh, classic uh, loadable dumbbell, Olympic uh, sleeve size loadable dumbbell. So what's great about these adjustable ones is kind of the opposite of, or, or kind of the bad side of, of these is the good side of these. So rather than taking up a ton of space and being very expensive, they're extremely economical and take up very little space. And these new bells have a really cool function. The way that they adjust is you just twist that handle and lift off. And that's gonna only take the plate, the amount of weight that you need. Do it again there. And so that's, uh, you know, even if you are doing supersets or drop sets, that's actually not too cumbersome to do in between. Of course, you can't have multiple athletes using them at the same time. So, and if you, as far as durability goes, if you were to say, uh, snatch one of these and completely drop it on the floor, uh, that is probably going to break. 
Whereas a fixed rubber head or urethane, if you drop it from above the head, not recommended, but it's not likely gonna break or do too much damage. Next, I'll move on to the classic uh, loadable dumbbell. So we only sell the uh, Olympic sleeve style ones. You will probably remember from your childhood the old school spindle lock ones, which were for the one inch plates, uh, which were really common maybe in the like 80s and 90s. Uh, we go with the Olympic sleeve ones. Everything we sell is Olympic sleeve. And these ones work by just, you take a plate and you load it on, put your collars on and away you go. So the perks of the loadable dumbbell is of course economy. So it's even more economical than an adjustable one, especially if you already own these plates, then it just becomes one more tool in your home gym and you can just slap on the weights you already have. You don't have to buy more weights, of course. <laughs> and it actually has um, probably nicer knurling and bushings than the other ones too, which is something you can't really get in the fixed head and adjustable. So it does have, the sleeves do rotate and they're quite uh, good looking and they're, um, they're uh, ridged as well. Uh, downside of them being, of course, they are a bit cumbersome and usually people will only use a maximum of 10 pound plates on there. Like you can fit 45s on there, but if you're doing a 45 pound, 45 each side press, it's kind of awkward. So you got to have a bunch of 10s typically in the smaller change ones. You can't fit that many on because you got to put space for your collar, which isn't ideal. And you know, as a, as a general, uh, to like add it to your repertoire, just to increase the amount of exercises you have access to, it's an excellent solution. Uh, so yeah, that's kind of a rundown of all the dumbbells that Bells of Steel sells, but also a decent reflection of the market as a whole. So if you want to buy any of these uh, awesome dumbbells, click the link below and let the gains begin.